Hello, I'm Dr. Umesh Narappa. I'm the head of the Department of Cardiovascular and Thoracic Surgery at um, BR Life SSNMC Super Specialty Hospital. Today, I'll be talking a little bit about bypass surgery, also known as coronary bypass surgery. The heart is a pump. It constantly pumps about five liters of blood every minute to all the different organs in the body. To do this much work, the heart itself needs uh, some blood supply which is supplied by uh, we, uh, the vessels called as coronary uh, blood vessels which run on the surface of the heart. Uh, these blood vessels are three in number, one in the front of the heart, one to the left and one to the right. And these uh, supply blood to the heart to help uh, in the pumping action. Now, coronary artery disease um, in simple terms is blockages in these coronary uh, blood vessels so that there is a decreased blood supply to the, uh, to the heart muscle and the muscle will not be able to work uh, to its uh, best capacity. Patients who have this um, coronary artery disease may present with uh, uh, difficulty in breathing or have chest pain, especially on uh, doing some kind of activity, or doing exercise, climbing up steps, um, or they may complain of difficulty in breathing, especially in patients who have had a heart attack previously and the pump has become weak. Um, any blockages in these blood vessels uh, would be treated either by medicines, by angioplasty or sometimes by bypass surgery when the blockages are multiple, when the heart is weak, uh, if the patient is diabetic. Uh, such patients are better treated by a, a procedure known as bypass surgery. During bypass surgery, we open the chest. Uh, we take a blood vessel from the inside of the chest wall known as the internal mammary artery and we take some blood vessels from the leg. Uh, these are uh, spare parts and we use these spare parts to, uh, to make a new path for the blood to, uh, to go beyond the blockage. Uh, it's like building a bypass road when a road is blocked and we make a new path for the uh, blood to, uh, to go beyond the block and supply the heart muscle. The two ways of doing a bypass surgery, one is to put the patient on a heart-lung machine which would do the function of the heart and the lung and to stop the heart and do the surgery. The other way is to do it on a beating heart without using the heart-lung machine. At SSNMC hospital, we uh, do almost all the procedures on a beating heart um, and um, quite a, a few of these surgeries are done without cutting the the, the breastbone through a small two inch incision on the left side of the chest. The advantage of this procedure is that uh, there is less pain, there is less bleeding, less chances of infection, uh, earlier uh, return to home and earlier return to normal uh, activity and work. So if you are having symptoms like um, chest pain, uh, especially while walking or climbing up steps or uh, difficulty in breathing, um, I would advise you to immediately see your doctor and get yourself checked up. For all you know, it might be uh, coronary artery disease and um, I know a timely treatment would be life-saving.